we're, we're moving on. We're, we're doing well. Um, new another business um, MOU for participation in Edmund Seed pooled purchase of photovoltaic system. I'm not sure. Right. Correctly. Um, would, would you introduce the uh, you know the, uh, well, the, the let's characters? Let's move that we adopt the MOU. Well, I thought. We, oh. If it's an adoption motion, we okay. need a motion and a sure. second before we discuss. Right. Okay. Can I have a motion? Is there a second? Second. Do we have a second? Second. Okay. Discussion? We'll present it um, first for you because this, this is something I'm not going to be able right. to Right. Uh, but uh, what I am shaking yeah. on is the, the history, who these people, who the characters are. Uh, introduce SCI, Optony, and uh, and the SEED program. And, um, okay. So Strategic Energy Innovations might already got a grant with Optony, which is a from the California Solar Initiative that established a mechanism for solar on the rooftops of municipalities and school districts in um, the northern counties. Um, focused around trying to provide upfront technical assistance services to these districts at no cost to the district unless they move forward with solar and then the technical assistance costs are actually built into the cost of the solar system. So that what one of the biggest barriers for municipalities and actually moving forward with solar has been that it, it's costly to actually do the assessment up front. Something that's not something that most are. So the partnership provides that level to the site totally for free. We'll provide that level of service. This site elects not to move forward with any projects at all. They don't they elect to move solar, then they basically what what to the meeting. Do you want to talk um. about that? I can't. Uh, the number of, in fact, all, uh, cities and I, I think all cities and special districts and uh, uh, in Noma and Nap, uh, Marin There's County. There's about 30 that signed up to. So uh, there, there are about 30 uh, on that invitation point where last month they attended um, a series of two workshops, the first presenting the financing and the second presenting technical aspects. And uh, I was most in financing. And there are, what they what they will do is put together a request for proposal for the entire package for if the uh, decide to participate, then there will be a large um, um, RFP. Um, you get established companies that are able to respond to that, uh, some economies of scale, and the RFP uh, go, as far as financing, it can go one of two ways, uh, well, three ways, actually. One is outright purchase, in which case uh, um, you own and maintain the payoff over maybe timeline that they show. The other would be a, uh, a lease, uh, basically you own a lease loan for Third would be a uh, our purchase agreement. Our um, upfront costs are very minimal, but uh, someone you sign an agreement with someone and install and maintain these things, own them, life of the agreement, which is and uh, they make your money because they sell us the power, and we have to agree to purchase all the power. Um, on an, on, a, on an annual basis, not months. So, the trick then is sizing the uh, facilities in order to make it um, to where uh, we don't have to purchase power that we can't use. We're purchasing power from them at a set cost that is below PG. They have an inflator, one or two here over the 20 years, and um, saving a little money on paying less than we would be with P, and that benefit increases over the as the spread between what we're paying uh, to the uh, owner, or less than the uh, power rates increase, and they've got you know the power rate increases over roughly what to expect. Our power expenditure over time has matched that because we've done. At any rate, to uh, I, I have the the uh, uh, PDFs of their patients, and we can go into that. Also, the stuff I sent you, uh, if you can look at it, if you want to go through it. District, what I would like to do now is just make sure you all have the information about it. I exchanged emails with the uh, staffer at Optony who's handling this other one. He says that by the timeline for getting the MOUs in and all these districts, bring it up next time for actual adoption of that. 
They've also given you some outlined in blue areas where they think they could put saves. And part of the, what the provider uh, do is, and built into the cost <coughs> would be the structures. And if you notice, they've taken the parking lot. They're talking that. about putting parking structures, so like cardboard things out. Which it actually looks really nice. Well, yeah, they, they end up gorgeous. serving as shape structures. Some, some do, and uh, and you can. I've seen different. I saw different designs. Some of them look really um, industrial. Uh, some can be made to uh, to look more decorative. I thought there would be some pushback about the parking. Although if you you know park your car in the sun out there, you, you, but it would really impact the look part. You wouldn't be driving by the park and seeing this park, you parking lot. You would park these big structures. So um, I e exchanged emails with him uh, over the last couple of days, and uh, he's put some other squares over by the pool where I suggested we might be able to put offsetting um, structures because, and he's he's uh, uh, sized them larger than what I had in mind. But one is where the existing structure is. The other is where we staff have been talking about taking out the little square of lawn between the shade structure and the dock. Also, we, one place we wanted a uh, arbor or something uh, was over the uh, the picnic area, the rental area between the park and the uh, playground area, the pool, the top pool. Can I, so, can I just say one more thing, Ms. Mm -hmm. We're assigning a million. That doesn't mean that we're right, right. I guess what I'm trying, to, I'm trying to get to is that we have a, we have a lot of other things. I have to leave soon. We have a consultant waiting, and it seems as if a lot of these yeah. questions are going to take a lot of time. So I really, I, I think we'll we're going to right. We have to answer it next month. Yeah. Otherwise, we'll lose yes. But I agree that we can't answer it this month because I just saw it. So we yeah. did approve the MOU, though. Right. To have you. Yeah. Yeah. could approve the MOU tonight if you wanted to. It doesn't. It doesn't obligate us. Anything except except all of their services and then buy it from someone else. If, the, if we, we yeah, if we buy it from if we don't go forward with this partnership, right. But we end up installing something else, then we have to take right. partnership. Right. Yes. That's the that's only the only system. commitment. I I'd read still it. like to have more of a month. I'd yeah. still like to have a month to consider that. Yeah, but we had a motion. Yeah, I can withdraw. Out, so. I'll withdraw my motion. Well, why don't we? I mean, are we? What we Bill doesn't want to vote on it. Let's just, can, I don't, just just withdraw the motion until next month. Well, right, but again, like it just again like. Passing the motion doesn't mean that. So I figure we might. No, but it would mean that you just have ramifications. So I withdraw this the motion. Big, this is a big proposal to consider. Right. One, one. Well, yeah, that's why we gave to us ahead of time. If you want to move on, move on. With three days. We're going to spend more time talking about talking about. Okay. Let's move on. Um, okay. So.